You know, when you're a full-time RVer, you're not just camping, you're living your life. So when people just say, oh, that's nice that you're camping, I think it's a whole lot of hooey. I can feel you right cheering for me. Now, the beautiful thing about being an RV or full-time is you're not really a tourist. You're living your life, and you're living here. And you're not here for a good time. You are here for a long time. And that's the way you should do it. So you're not really dragging your RV down to Southern California or Arizona for a week or two weeks or three weeks and hoping to, you know, hit the Grand Canyon, Disneyland, and all that kind of shit, which is great, don't get me wrong, because I do all that stuff too. But there is no hurry when you are a full-timer, and that is the way you should do it. There's a reason you got wheels on your RV. It's to keep those damn wheels on the ground and keep them moving and grooving. And that's really what you should do. Because otherwise, you're just uh, denying yourself a lot of great gratification of fun, joy, and adventure. You know, keeping your RV too close to home is uh, for those people that are workaholics that... Uh, can't get away from uh, the job and shit like that. Oh, we got people uh, laughing at me doing my video. That's good. I love that. People with sense of humor. Um, so, you know, when you talk to people and they go, uh, I don't even have a TV in my RV because I'm here to camp and uh, get peace and quiet. Well, good for you. Well, guess what? If I want to watch TV for four hours, I'm at home and I can do that. Yeah, I'm not going to say yeah, I'm going to do that every damn day, but it's no different if I want to sleep in until 11 o'clock. I can do that if I want to. If I want to get up at 6 in the morning early like I often do, I can do that too. It's all up to you if you're a full-time RVer. And uh, seeing America and the rest of the world uh, traveling around, uh, you know, everywhere that I've been in the last few years, Europe and uh, the Caribbean, etc., etc., that's what it's all about. Sometimes you even park the RV and you get a condo. Sometimes you put your dog in the kennel and you fly to Europe. Sometimes you just bounce around with your RV and that's what it is all about. You live your life and your RV is just a, a vehicle that you use as your home base to do the things you want to do. And that's what it's about. Beautiful day here in Palm Desert and um, about 23 Celsius so it's uh, kind of like low to mid 70s perfect day and uh, I would suggest anybody who is uh, on the fence to come down to Southern California Arizona Nevada this winter get her done and just do it don't worry everything's fine so I got a little uh, plane leaving Palm Springs Airport above me making a little bit of racket so I'm gonna cut this a bit short so in the meantime folks stay safe keep your wheels on the ground